Perseverance has some of the most ambitious science goals that we've ever attempted on the surface of Mars. Now, in order to achieve these, we need to travel long distances and over a variety of terrains. The enabling technology for this is the rover's mobility system. Now, let's queue up my first video where you'll see the rover driving here in our clean room. And while you look at that, I can talk you through some of the specs the rover has. Perseverance is a rugged, all-terrain vehicle. It has a clearance of two feet, a wheel diameter of 21 inches. It can go over obstacles of up to 40 centimeters, that's just over a foot, and it can go up slopes of up to 30 degrees, so that's about a 57% grade. The rover has a top speed of 0.1 mile per hour, but most importantly, it can self-drive on Mars. Now remember, Mars doesn't have roads, it doesn't have maps, it doesn't have GPS, and yet, Perseverance can self-drive for distances of up to 200 meters per day. In order to get there, in order to get to these specs, we've had to make some pretty significant upgrades from, uh, from Perseverance's predecessor, which was Curiosity. The first upgrade that we made is to its wheels, and let's look at slide number two, where you'll see the difference between the Curiosity and the Perseverance wheels. And we essentially went back to the drawing board here. You can see that the Perseverance tread pattern is much tighter, much closer together, and the treads are actually taller, which gives the wheels better traction. You can also see that the treads have a smooth sinusoidal pattern rather than the jagged pattern that Curiosity had. That, gives a, that gets rid of the hot spots that cause damage on the Curiosity wheels and gives us confidence with that and along with the hundreds of hours of testing obviously that we've done here on Earth that these wheels will survive the harsh Martian environment that they will be driving on.